Hi folks, this is Brooks Brown with Advanced Purification and today we're going to actually show you how to treat a car with our Air high output ozone generator. Uh, and quite frankly what you can do with this is you can sanitize your car, get rid of smoke odors, body odor, maybe you transport pets a lot, perhaps your car has been involved in a flood and whatnot, and maybe it has a mold e uh, issue. But regardless of the odor involved in the car, um, you can take care of that very easily with a Sanisir high output ozone generator. So we're going to show you how to do this, folks. First of all, the thing you want to do, uh, this is actually what has happened, this is a real situation, obviously. Um, we have purchased this car for my daughter. It's about 10 years old. It has 100,000 miles on it. The prior owner was a heavy smoker, and it is a pretty potent smell that I'm, I can even pick up on standing right here. Um, we are going to get rid of this smoke odor and ultimately we got a great deal on this car because we kind of know the powers of ozone and unfortunately the other owner did not. So we got a great deal on it um, knowing that we could clean up this situation. So here's the f first couple things you want to do. Certainly you want to get in the car, you want to clean all the surface areas, clean the, you know, all the, the dash and whatnot, shampoo the carpets, clean the seats whether they're, whether they're um, uh, leather or fabric and whatnot, you want to do, uh, clean all the surface areas there. And before you actually then treat, one of the things you want to do is you want to remove the car mat so that you can sanitize all the way around this because this ozone is a gas and it's going to travel anywhere air currents travel. But if you leave the mats down, obviously underneath the mat, you know, will not maybe get as sanitized and odor uh, eliminated quite as well as if you had taken it out of the vehicle. So we're going to take these and put them into the back of the vehicle, kind of in a, in a format in which will allow air to kind of get all the way around them. we we'll actually remove these. Um, so we'll stack all the mats back here. And so that air will get all the way around this and properly sanitize it. Okay. All right. Only one more mat to go. Some mat up here, yeah, real. So, here's what we're talking about here. We basically cleaned everything as far as shampooing, cleaned all the windows, um, shampooed the carpets, cleaned all the fabric and everything that went out of the car. And now, we're going to witness the powers of our ozone generator here. What you want to do, well, the other thing that you don't want to do. You guys have all probably seen these hanging tags that basically are different scents and whatnot. You don't want to use these. This is a chemical pollutant that's in, intended to inhale and mask odors, basically. So this is not the answer, folks, but ozone is. So let's go into that. And what we want to do here, because ozone is so powerful and you're treating a very small space, you don't need to treat it for very long. And what you want to do is treat it 30 minute increments. And if 30 minutes is not enough, then you can repeat the process, treat for another 30 minutes until basically the odor is gone. So we're going to start with 30 minutes. We use a timer here, folks. And ultimately, we like the type of timer in which you can, you can push and pull out the tabs versus the ones that you can remove. Uh, the ones that you can remove, they don't give you enough tabs when you're treating an uh, indoor environment, home and whatnot to allow you the flexibility to turn it on and off as many times as you need to. So again, we're going to set this for 30 minutes. I'm going to get this all set. And ultimately, the other thing you need to do is you need to run the vehicle during the treatment process. Uh, and therefore, you're going to have to run this vehicle outside. You want to make sure that you don't have any inclement, inclement weather coming, no, no uh, you know, rain or snow and whatnot, because you're, you're dealing with an electrical device, 
and you don't want to get water in that device. So we're going to plug this in. Actually, the first thing we're going to do is roll down the window. We want to uh, put this in the window primarily because ozone generators feed off of fresh oxygen. And if you put it in the car, then the generator will be feeding off of um, ozone. And you won't have very fresh ozone there. So ultimately, we're going to take this. Plug in the uh, the timer. Plug in the transfer, the generator. The other thing, too, folks, is based on how big your vehicle and how bad the pollutant is. This device actually has two settings. This this particular generator. There's 7,000 milligrams per hour, 14,000 milligrams per hour. I'm going to run this at seven because it's relatively small space. And I've, we've been in situations where the odor is even worse. If it, if it is in that situation, then we'll run it at 14. We're going to try it for a half hour on the 7,000 setting. So we're going to set this using the handle. Set it here. There's your over here. We've got the one turned on. Alright, and the other thing you want to do too, folks, is you want to leave the car running, and ultimately you want to have the air set on so that it is not um, so that it's circulating the inside air only and not bringing in out the outside air. And the reason for that is you want the uh, gas to basically get into the uh, heat and air system and clean out that ductwork as well. It's really important that you do that. So during the treatment process you're going to run your car and your air based on inside air, not outside air. Okay, so we're ready to go. We've got the inside air piece going. We're on auto. It's at about 70 degrees. Doesn't really matter. And we're going to actually uh, take this piece. Uh, actually, I need to fill this void, so if you would, hang on two seconds, I'm going to go get the piece for that. If you would, pause it, we'll be right back. So basically what we're going to do, folks, we're going to take a piece, it could be a towel or a piece of cardboard or uh, anything really that you can fill this void with. It doesn't have to be perfect, it doesn't have to be airtight, but ultimately you don't want this large gap here uh, exposing too much outside air so it wouldn't allow the ozone to build up inside. So okay, we're all set. We'll close things up. And we're going to set this for half an hour. Okay, folks, you can hear that running. Let me move a little bit closer here and just hear it. We've got the one side on versus the other because ultimately, again, it's a small space. You don't need the full powers of this ozone generator. So we're going to run this for a half an hour. So we're going to come back and we're going to see how, how, well it, how well it did. Okay folks, we're, we're back a half hour later and indeed the unit has turned off. So what we're going to do, I'm going to actually go around the other side. In case we have to turn it back on, I don't want to dismantle things, so we're going to walk around the other side here. And do, do the sniff test, which is the key to knowing whether we had success or not. Wow, that's a lot better. I mean, it smells wow. great. Um, ultimately, with as little as a half hour with ozone, and half, and half the, what uh, the output can be with that unit, 7,000 milligrams an hour versus a 14, we fixed a pretty serious smoke issue in here. I mean, it was, it was pretty potent. Um, wouldn't you agree, Gabrielle? Yeah. Um, so, ultimately, you've got a new smelling car. Uh, 100,000 miles on it and smelled the high heaven before, uh, uh, you know, from the previous owner. So, folks, if, you, if you've got a vehicle, a, a car, a boat, RV, a truck, whatever it be, 
Um, you can sanitize it and get rid of those uh, bad odors with, with a Sanitaire High Output Ozone Generator. So give us a call at 877-979-PURE. Uh, That's 877-979-7873. Or look us up on the web at www.sanusair. That's S-A-N-U-S-A-E-R dot com. Again, I'm Brooks Brown with Advanced Purification, helping people live healthier lives.